In this video, you will see how to set up the geolocation for your project using the Civil Engineer role with the Building and Civil Assemblies app and the data setup. First of all, you need to define the CRS, the coordinate reference system for your project. They can be found in the EPSG registry website where you can search either by name, either using a map, and pick the CRS you're interested in. The important information is the EPSG number. All the CRS are also available in your 3D experience install under Resources, Geolocation. From there, you can extract the 3D XML for your EPSG number and save it locally on your machine. Now you need to import the CRS 3D XML. Make sure you have the leader role or an equivalent allowing you to import data. Using the plus import button, browse and import the 3D XML inside your platform as reference. Now you can use the Data Setup app if you want the CRS to be applied by default to your project or collaborative space. This step is not mandatory. And if you don't do it, you will have to apply manually your CRS each time you apply geolocation on new parts. This is an administrator job, so it requires access to the owner role. Look for geolocation resources and create a new resource. Assign the CRS you imported to that resource. Optionally, you can also define if you want to leave the capability or not to the users to change the CRS. A sample XML file is now also available in your install to define the usage rule of the CRS. Finally, you can drag and drop this geolocation resource to your project to set it as default. And do not forget to save. The data setup tab can now be closed and you can now go back to the leader role, which is the default role used to design. Now, if you create a new product, which can be a site or a building, for example, you can set its geolocation using the Building and Civil Assemblies app. Click on the geolocation icon and use the hyperlink to activate the geolocation. As you can see, the CRS we imported has been set as default. We can also move the origin of the project closer to our infrastructure using easting and northing coordinates. Note that those coordinates are automatically converted in latitude and longitude, which allow us to quickly check the accuracy by opening it in a map application on the web.